If you are interested why old cars more safer than modern cars, then keep watching this video. Today we cover safety systems which present in modern cars and which was in olden days cars. Patrick's garage. And first of all, emergency situation. This should be done mechanically. All should be done mechanically. If we want to go away from broken car, we need to get exit. And uh, one interesting thing. I have noticed that since 70s they started to install windshields with glue, not with rubber, which was in 60s and before. And you can easily pull out their window in emergency situation to go out from the car. But you can't do this in modern car because front window and even rear window fixed with special glue. You can't pull it away. And why they do this so why they installed windows that way? Just because they want to get additional money when your window cracks and you need to replace it, you can't do this work yourself. You need to go to specialist with special equipment. Yes, now there are a lot of guys which offer uh, replacing of windows uh, and they go to your location that's not good you need to replace front window stationery you go to the shop workshop where they have uh, all equipment to make this work correctly and we can do this so this is one of the reasons why they making this uh, front window so that we can't replace it by our own hands. Yes, they can say that this is a part of uh, body, body will be more strong if we uh, glue this uh, window to the frame. No. All cars was very reliable, very strong metal with rubber seal. You can pull it out and uh, install it into its place. Maybe with help with, uh, with your friends. But glue, glue with uh, the window installation should be... This procedure should be done only by specialists. <laughs> Just I remember. A funny story was with my co-worker one uh he go <laughs> with his volkswagen uh, go to the um, shop probably not dealer but <laughs> when he, he return he, he shut the door and his front window falls away <laughs> to the hood <laughs> very funny but sadly yes so you never going to allow these clowns to replace your windows. And yes, one thing. <laughs> we covered topic with windows, but doors. They start making uh, locks, electrical locks for the doors. I mean, not mechanically with key, but key connected by wires with lock. So, if uh, something wrong with electrical system, we can't go away where our emergency exit. We can't go through windows, we can't go through doors. Not good. Not good. Because uh, to the doors always get uh, what gets inside, always a little bit, but it will be inside the door. Electrical equipment never was so friendly with water. It will be rusty, it uh, will glitching and crap like that. Yes, they 
Modern cars have a lot of safety, uh, like airbags, <laughs> which can easily broken your nose. And um, I think will be enough seat belts with but without retractors, with manually regulation seat belt, like was in sixties. They never use never using retractors because what will be in th if their car lying on the back retractor never allow to you to pull out the seat belt to lose it a little and uh, buckling out to go away also strange and uh, main safety system brakes system in 60s just for example will be my volvo two sockets braking system with each uh, caliper uh, four pistons for each front caliper and for each uh, rear calipers two pistons and uh, which calipers which design of calipers will be more fast with four pistons or with one pistons with one piston like in uh, modern cars now they're using one piston two pistons squeezing more faster breaking disc there is no arguing that yes one piston will be more cheaper i agreed i agreed what more interesting more than this interesting that modern cars more faster they increase their speed more faster and uh, they can go more faster for what we have speed limits everywhere and uh, we never going to argue with this fact uh, that more high speed than more dangerous driving you never save uh, passengers pedestrians if uh, any maybe not good person sitting inside the car maybe he suffer from mental illness or maybe he suffer from any another disease or just he insane you never save with any equipment no you can't save passengers you can save pedestrians if any idiots behind the wheel you can do nothing with safety system never never will help in this situation yes we cover topic with locks with windows but how we can stop the car if something go wrong with our braking system emergency braking system mechanical braking system but now in modern cars they made them electrical with electrical motor but what we going to do if something wrong with electrical system and something wrong with battery we can't stop the car very dangerous yes maybe not so important and you maybe find this hilarious they not putting in in the trunk their spare tire only strange balloon like spray to for what i do even don't know how we can using this with a broken tire and in a spare tire in spare tire you always have sources of air you can using this air for breath a little who knows what can be happen and yes these safety systems create a lot of uh, problems when we maintain our car by our hands we we can't uh, replace braking fluid for system with abs without equipment not any abs systems uh, can save us from 
idiots. Thank you so much for watching to the end. Please liking, sharing, subscribing. I really appreciate it. Till next time.